Hi everyone, welcome back to Code Step by Step. My name is Anil, and in this TypeScript video tutorial, we will learn about object type. Till now, we learned about uh, what is number type, string type, and boolean, and now we are talking about object type. So, object type is basically a combination of number, string, and boolean kind of data type, right? We will learn it in the detail but before that i want to share some information with you if you are looking to purchase domain name or hosting then you can purchase it with domain racer here you can see that plans are just started with the 59 rupees per month and you will get light speed technology ssd disk and much more features and this is the most affordable ssd linux hosting so go and grab the benefits all right come back here and first of all, I am creating a file with the name of object and defining a simple object. And then I will tell you that why we need the type of object, right? So let me create here object.ts. Now let me take a const with the name of person. And here uh, I am defining some fields like uh, name can be Peter, age, uh, let's say 30 and all right and now i can console it console dot one and here i can put like a person but now i want to decide that and i just want to restrict that this name should have only two fields it should not be three four or only one fields it must have to be two fields so how we can do it for that time we can define the type of object right so how we can define so the simple and basic way is we can just simply put here object right but this is not really useful here you can see that this is the type of object but here we are just telling to the person that uh, you have a object and it can have multiple keys but we did not define the name of keys so that if i am trying to get the name it will just simply tell that property name does not exist with the type of object so what we can do we can create an object and we can tell them these property should be here so i am just creating an object like this and now i can put here name should be string age can be string again oh sorry it, it, it should be number right it should be number and now this is working fine so now i can get here like dollar name, uh, do person name, age. So let's say if I'm just going, trying to get here email, I cannot get because this is not defined here, right? So if I just need it, I can simply put here email like abc at the rate test.com, right? And I must have to define here the type of uh, in, in the object type i must have to define here email also so i can define here string now this is working fine so now uh, what I actually feel here so let's say this object is a huge use it have around 10 keys or 20 keys so how i can handle with that that time we can just use make it separately right how we can make it separately so just make a copy of it and let me define it with a type and here I can say this that object type or you can take any name whatever you want and simply paste it here now we can use this object type like this right and if I just remove the email from here then you can see that we again got the error here right so with that we can define the object type really great so now if we just define this uh, object type separately this is a reusable also let's say i have a uh, another object with the name of user right so i can use this and it have the same fields and all right that time we can also uh, reuse this type with the person as well as the user also right so that way we can define the object and all so what kind of question in interviews that can be asked over the object so first thing is what is the primary reason to define uh, 
object type the reason is we can just tell the object that we need uh, that many keys and the keys should be like type of number and string and boolean and all right and we can uh, now the second question can be that can we reuse the object yes we can make it this a uh, type of object and we can reuse when uh, the two objects have the same properties and same values right so thanks for watching this video if you still have any kind of query you can ask me in the comment box